What's up everyone? Glad you're here today. I'm hanging out with my favorite flashlights, the O-Light, and I got a good little slew to go through for you, but I wanted to show you why these might be a good stocking stuffer. So let's dive into some deets on these awesome little flashlights. Ah! So before I go into big details, I want to let you know, if you click the link below, you can get 30% off of this light and you can get 40% off if you bundle it with the i3T light. Um, that's a smaller kind of keychain style light. If you spend over $200, you're going to get one of these S2Rs for free. If you spend over $300, you're going to get a Seeker 2 in black for free. If you spend over $400, bucks, you are going to get a Warrior X, which I don't even have and if you spend over 500 bucks you're gonna get a job a lot pro man I can't even keep track I don't even know all these flashlights ah, I can't even keep track so in 2018 I bought this Olight S1R on Amazon for 60 bucks um, I couldn't find it in the Dodge forever and then Olight actually reached out once my YouTube channel started growing and wondered if I wanted to work with them test out some flashlights show you guys you know how they work yada 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 well I've had a lot of different companies do that as the channel grows and I really didn't feel like a lot of them were that good a fit um, Olight though is something that fits into my lifestyle on a daily basis and they produce some amazing quality products um, and when it's really dark out there and you don't have a light switch to turn on and you don't have shore power and you're not always plugged in you're always off the grid it's nice to be able to rely on some good light so I think these would be a great stocking stuffer for the overlander in your life I'm sure that they've got a flashlight already but if they don't have an Olight it's probably not that bright compared to these to be honest with you this is the S1R baton um, this I haven't charged this in probably a year and a half or two years and uh, like I said I got it lost in the Dodge Mahal and I just found it in time for this video um, so I love this little thing it's super duper teeny small you could clip this onto your hat or something like that and like not even really notice it's there this is the S2R baton this is one step up a little bit bigger and uh, a little bit brighter um, I don't know does the oh yeah of course the S1R does the, the strobe as well this one over here so this is the M2R so this guy is more of a spot um, this thing is really good for putting uh, you know like a big spot right on something this is uh, gun mountable I did a video on that where you can mount this on a rifle it's also got a switch on the back there um, that you can hook up to the pressure sensor switch so this is great for anybody that wants to hook up their flashlight to a rifle also talking to Olight about doing some handlebar mounts for bicycles and things this bad boy though this is my favorite this is the Seeker 2 3000 lumen triple LED um, flashlight and when I first got this this was actually the first sponsored light that I got from Olight um, I was really impressed I did a really long video that was <laughs> kind of crazy how many details I went into on it but anyways so when Olight said hey we're coming out with the Seeker 2 Pro orange and we're doing a big you know Black Friday sale I was stoked to help out with that so this is the Seeker 2 Pro orange now it's not just a different color it's actually different in a lot of ways it's a little bit taller also this grip that they have on here so it's a really nice grip compared to the old Seeker 2 which doesn't really have any grip it's kind of just got these knurled surfaces um, but yeah this grip is really great the other thing that's different is the button um, you can see the button has these little green lights that light up around it to indicate uh, the battery level and also the brightness that you're set at and the button pops out a little bit more so you can kind of just feel it when you need it um, those are really the only differences other than that it's pretty much the same um, I believe the first Seeker 2 is 3000 this one's 3200 lumens but the cool thing also is what it comes in what comes in the pack with it 
So, in the box of the new Seeker 2, you'll find it comes with a really cool carrying case that you can put onto a belt loop or something like that, or just put on your door, have a flashlight mounted. Also, I love this. This is a new charge port that comes with uh, 3M backing. It even comes with all the stuff you need to actually mount it. So let's dump all this stuff out. So, comes with screws and little dealies and you can drill this into your wall or something like that and have a little charge port. So this is really cool. You can just like drill it up into the camper and have a charge port. Um, they also give you a longer cable, of course, so you can run that and a nice little deal there. So yeah, I love this new charging thing, uh, the wall. The wall port dealy bob. That's great. Yeah, this case is pretty nifty. These are waterproof also, you guys. They've got a really good waterproof seal on there, so you can be confident mobbing through the water. All right, well, we've chatted about it enough. I've showed you some shots of it outside. Now, let's get, uh, let's get a test going. Let's get this thing outdoors for you. Yep, I just love this seeker too. Whoa, what's this? Oh my gosh, what? It's an orange seeker too. No, that is beautiful. Whoa, it's got a different button. Cool, let's check this thing out. You can see that mountain, you can't even see it in the camera. Oh yeah, I see, that's that mountain over there. You can see it now. That's a couple hundred yards away or something. It's awesome. Well, hey, thanks so much for watching my video about the Olight flashlights and the new Black Friday sale they got going on. This sale is going to be going on from the 28th to the 1st, so be sure you swoop some lights in that time. Seriously, though, there's a lot of things that you could get your fellow Overlander for Christmas. I think these are a good option. At the end of the day, though, um... You want to make sure to keep this lifestyle minimal and only include things that are, you know, truly something you might need. Um, you know, it, it, supporting products and doing product videos is kind of funny because I, I, a big reason I did this lifestyle was to be more minimal. Um, so, you know, it's funny sometimes to be talking about products I use and um, telling people, maybe promoting these products in a way. But at the end of the day, like I said, these Olight flashlights make me feel more secure out in the middle of nowhere at dark if I need to go and Coda runs off and I need to go chase her or we need to work on the truck or something like that at night. Um, or you just want to look around. It's nice to have a good flashlight. It's nice to have portable power stations. It's nice to have certain things um, that I am doing videos on as far as products. So I hope you enjoy them. I hope you appreciate the products and the opinions. Um, of course, there's a lot of great flashlights out there. So be sure to drop a comment. Let me know what you think. What do you think of this new mullet kind of thing I got going here? It's kind of interesting as well. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any of the action from the channel. Um, I'm going to be giving you guys a big update this week on my life, uh, how it's gone this past year with YouTube and everything, and where we're going in the future. So I'm excited for that. Stoked to have you along for the ride. The question always is, are you down to mob? Ah!